Okay everyone, as promised, I'm going to do a more detailed video now of the contents, now that I'm back home. Um, we're working as fast as we can, me and my wife, on getting all this for you. But this is the Satsuma Fizz bottle that I found kind of marking the site, laying down on the mound, so that I knew I was in the right place and wasn't trespassing. Uh, of course, the cartridge case. And inside of this, we have a gas mask. We have a survival guide, Department of the Army Field Manual. Uh, this is marked, I don't think you're going to be able to see it, uh, but the Poncho, ABC, and some other numbers. Production June 03. This is the tape that was used to seal the entire box as I went. Flashlight. Oh, battery's already in it. Some utility cord. And the piece that interests me, and I missed it at first, it's a puzzle piece. But it looks like it has an eye on it. I'm going to try and get a picture of this. Maybe we can see this a little bit better. Um, the video camera just does not seem to be picking this up. about the best shot I can get of it. All right, we've got the hatchet, some extra batteries. Heating component for rations, a box of three. And it is Mark Calif, California, surplus 298. Looks like an old tag. Emergency drinking water. Matches. All this stuff looks pretty old. Emergency blanket. little can opener. Oh, there's more puzzle pieces here. This looks like... Definitely have an eye. It's just a piece that tore off one of the boxes. I think it's this one with the ration heater. Another box of matches. I don't see anything hidden or written inside of them. A compass whistle combo. Some glow light sticks. One day survival bar. 
apple cinnamon with a five year shelf life. Another light stick. Military rations. They are sealed, so I doubt anything is stuffed inside. Oh, here we go. Southwest style beef and black beans. Grilled jalapeno pepper jack flavored beef patty. Ratatouille. Cheese tortellini and tomato sauce. Chicken with tomatoes and feta. Now, we are down back to the letter. I'm assuming this is what's going to be on the USB and that will be my next video. I'm going to get to that as soon as possible. I'm going to try and set it up to where I'm taking a video as I put it in and I'm hoping nothing is uh, destroyed while I'm doing so. Um, This looks like a Swiss Army knife, but as I'm looking inside of it, this looks like a USB as well. Looks like there's actually two of them. And finally, we have that bottle opener, USB. And that is everything that was inside. So I'll go and upload this, and then it's time to work on these USBs.